Welcome in, welcome to our um, online property tour. Our plan here today is to get everybody to come in and do some painting, right? Uh, we got the whole team here today. This is the property. We're in Wilmington, Delaware. Right now, I know I got my people in New York. What's up? I got some people in different areas. How's everybody doing? Right? Um, we're gonna do a couple of things today. First, we're gonna walk through the property. This is a fix and flip property that, that we're doing. Um, we're gonna walk through the property just to kind of show you. This is this construction going on. We have the contractors here. And we're gonna walk through the property. We're gonna talk numbers also today. Uh, we'll talk a little bit about how the property was acquired, right? How we got this property, um, how we funded it, right? And what's the strategy? We're gonna talk about the stra strategy, strategies, <laughs> right? Um, I want you guys to know, we got a couple of team members here that's out here with us because the, the, one of the main plans for today was to actually paint the house. This is my guy, Jason. Yes, yes, right? we here. We here. Jason's one of my partners on this deal, right? He's also one of the lenders on the deal, right? And some of you that are brand new that are watching, well, we're going to show you exactly how we do this real estate thing um, within our system, within our group, and, and how we get it going. So now, a couple of things that's happening. There's construction going on. He got the heat on inside. It's really loud. But you're going to hear that. Oh, you're going to hear everything. You're going to see. We're going to pull the curtains back. All right. So this is kind of like the backstage part of everything. We're going backstage to see exactly what the investor has to deal with. Not everything every time is perfect. You understand? Most of the time when you're dealing with a property, not everything is perfect. What makes it easier to deal with is the people that you have around you for us sometimes the support that we have so with the support we're able to function with less stress you understand it's gonna be some stress it's because it's always stress <laughs> it's never easy it's never easy this isn't something you see on tv exactly right. there's stress right now there's right. always there's always a little stress right now there's always a little fire to put out when you're doing real estate and that's all right but it's all um, right we make it fun the thing is, what you want to do, and what we do, is we feel that we're built for that, and we learn how to deal with um, different aspects of getting real estate, dealing with a property, and things like that. Right, so I want you to get a span of the outside of the house over here. As you see, we got contractors working on it right now, live. You know? Right, so you just give them a span of the building. See, we always got the bandit signs working too. I right. Know, I see that. I see bandit that. signs always working. <laughs> right. But we want to talk about that. Zoom in on this bandit sign, right? So you see this here? How to invest in rental properties. One of the things we do is we definitely show you how to invest in rental properties. This is a rental property, and we advertise in our business to show you how to invest in rental properties. Another thing we do, come to this sign. I'm sure some of you people saw this sign I'll right I'll let here. him talk about his sign. Yeah. That's his I'm sign. I'm sure some of you people saw this sign right here, but as you see, it could be in New York, it could be here in Delaware, it doesn't matter. We put those signs everywhere to find out, hey, you know, you never know. Somebody might be interested in doing real estate. All right, well, we're the people we want to connect with. We're a nice community of local investors or nationwide, it doesn't matter. And we show you, show you how to make some more money doing real estate. All right? All right. And also, another sign that we have, as you see, right here, the for sale by owner sign, right? Yeah, now, mm -hmm. the for sale by owner sign is, it's for sale. The property is 100% for sale, and if you want to buy it, let us know. <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> if you want to buy it, let us know, all right? So now we're gonna go inside and, and see a little bit, a little bit more about the property. It was a two bed, no, it was a four bedroom, one bath, right. right? So what we did is we turned it into a three, two and a half. Right. You got that? Three beds, two and a half baths. That's from a four by one. From a four one, right? 
and, and there's some work going on, so we're gonna take you inside and, and show you a little bit about what's going on. Now, there is gonna be some noise. In the chat, you can let us know. I'm gonna, we're gonna go to my other computer. I can look at the chat, so we'll know. Actually, we'll go upstairs. We're gonna go upstairs. All right, just follow me. Because it's cold, right? We're in the Northeast, it's cold. We have an actual heater that's blowing. It's a good heater because it warms up the whole place. So one of the things we did is we changed this door and I'll just take you on a quick tour of inside the property. All right, so now, you can still hear me. I'm sure you can still hear me, but we got the heater going on. This the heater. And we're going to walk this way first. This area where I'm standing is, would be the living room, right? So if you look over here, this whole area here is the living room. All right, let's walk this way. This area here is the kitchen and dining room, right? And we see the, um, the contractors are working, right? And this used to be, they fixed this beam. We used to have a beam problem here. This used to be held up with a jack. And tell me your name. Derry. Derry, what's up, brother? How you doing? How you been? I'm doing great. I see you here. Yeah. That's good. All right, so this area right here is going to be the kitchen, right? So this is going to be the kitchen. So that you know we're online too, right? To let you know we're online, right? So I'm online broadcasting at the same time I'm going to talk Just to let you guys know, all right? Um, Y'all can say hi to the camera. Right? <laughs> so we do have we do have guests and we're going to have team members. In a little while, you're going to see other things besides me. So this is the kitchen. And it's already quieter, even though the heat is going on over there. Right, What's right going on, here. brother? Right here, it's good. I'll come here. For the guests and everybody. Yeah, 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 yeah. we're gonna come. But I'm, I'm, we're gonna do so. The next part, we're gonna go upstairs, just so you get a tour of the house. So come this way. Now we got light. We got light and stuff. So right. now, over here, this is our half bath. Isn't it? It's kind of here. This wasn't even here. It looks the way it's running is smooth, right? So actually, you know what? We should talk about that. So this originally, is nice. right? Originally, this wasn't even here. So this was actually closed off. This was closed off. This wasn't here. It was just a full kitchen. So we did said, you know what? There was no bathroom on the first floor. So we said, all right, let's put a little half bathroom right here. And then for easy access, when people come in through this way, it will be a nice flow. So we open up this little doorway. So not only can you come in here, people, let's say they're sitting there for the living room or something like that, so they can now come into the bathroom, then easily walk through here to get to the kitchen or go downstairs. Whereas before with the flow you came in, you were stuck, so you had to go all the way around to access this area. So the flow kind of works through better when you push it up this way. All right. That, we thought that was a nice little addition to the property. Good? Yeah. All right. Now you want to go upstairs, downstairs? Now, now we're going to go upstairs. Going upstairs. Going upstairs. Right? There's more than team members. So even more of team members and, the and, some, guests. and some guests. You're going to hear from them in a minute. So we're going to go upstairs. Good. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Alright, I got some Uh let's start this one. Alright. So actually this is the floor that we're going to start painting. Right? 
So with everyone that's here, with the team members, this is the floor that we're gonna start painting. All right, this is the master bedroom. So in this bedroom, it's a master with a closet and a bath on this end here. All right, so you can see, as you can see, these walls were prepped for painting. So what we're gonna do as a team today is we're going to actually paint, okay. all right? Now, I got three guests, right? Let's just meet them because they're also here. These are people that are um, checking us out, checking out um, what we do, how we do our properties. Um, we're gonna talk to them for a little bit. We're gonna start with um, my guy here. This is Darry. He lives out in um, Wilmington. Where do you live? Maryland. You live in Maryland. So how far from here? Uh, like 30 minutes. 30 minutes, right? So um, I know we've been talking and he's been interested in scaling his business a little bit. And um, just how long have you been interested in doing this real estate game? Um, well, actually, probably about uh, two or three years. Two I've been doing uh, property management. I go in and clean out the houses and then I help the uh, bank sit resell the house. Oh, so when they go into foreclosure, you go in, clean them out, so people, like, so people can walk through and check them out. Investors can walk through. Yeah. So that's his business. And um, how'd you find us? I'm actually the sign outside. I was working on the house across the street. Right. And I uh, seen the sign, I called and I spoke to you. Right, the sign, we had a sign. This is one of the signs that you saw earlier, that sign was one of the signs he saw. Um, to, to get us out. And so now tell us, what are you looking to do? I'm um, actually, I want to actually purchase some properties and then uh, flip some. So. Purchase and flip, right? For profit? Yeah. That's what mostly everybody wants to do. Purchase and flip these properties for profit. All right, we're going to go over the numbers. Stick around. We're going to go over the numbers soon while we meet some people that's watching what we do. What we like to do as uh, investors, we're a community of investors. What we like to do is we like to showcase how we do this thing. A lot of times, and, and you guys get a test, it, most of the time, you won't get an investor or people to walk in during this process. No, they don't want to come until it's actually done. Right, you don't come in until it's actually done. And when it's actually done, what's there to learn? This, this is the learning process. This part here, this is the part where you learn. This is the part um, where the contractors are working and the house is not done. This is one of the ma major parts that we feel is a good time um, for everyone to see. All right, let's meet. I never met this man. <laughs> let's meet him. Andrew. What's your name? Andrew. Andrew. What's up, Andrew? What's up? So how'd you find us? Uh, same thing. I saw a sign, but yeah, I live in New Jersey near Cherry Hill. Oh, Cherry Hill. Cherry Hill's not far. It's like 40 minutes away. We got property in Camden, which is the next exit, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you saw the sign here? No, I saw it in Cherry Hill. There's okay. one in Cherry Hill that said, uh, real estate investors, seek students. Right. So I've not been trying to find someone to actually teach me. You've been looking for somebody to teach you? Yeah. <laughs> actually teach you. What a coincidence, <laughs> right? He's looking for somebody to teach him, and the systems we use are designed for that. Right? They're actually designed for that. And how long have you been interested in doing that? Like a year. A whole year. Yeah, I've been studying it by myself. Right. I haven't found someone to person who right. hands on. Right, so what you're gonna see is it's a team of us. Yeah. Right? You can always do this by yourself. But why not do it with you can you know what the thing is I'm still my own business. I'm my yeah. own entity. Now but I have a team. I have other people that I can help and, and, and help me also figure out what's the numbers, how to learn, yeah. what to do. That's really one of the things that when, when I started doing this, that's one of the things that was important to me was to just be around some other people that's doing it besides just myself. Because doing it by yourself you can get hurt and I got hurt doing that. I just jumped into real estate and I jumped in and I nearly drowned. Because I couldn't swim, you know? If you want to think about the terminology, I couldn't swim. I had to learn how to swim. So now that I know how to swim, this property here is a result of some of the things that I've learned in the system, all right? So, good to meet you, right? Good for hanging out. Y'all get to walk around with me. So this, like I said, we're gonna paint this room. <clears throat> Sometime today. I was hoping to get the painting with the team online. That 
might still happen. We're going to work on that. So come with me this way. Right here is another bathroom that they're working on. Right? I'm in this room. This is another bathroom. This is the tour section. This is another bathroom. Um, this is the main. This at, when we first came, this was the only bathroom. Right? This was the only bathroom. So now, this is now one of the three bathrooms that we added to this property. All right. This one is another. This room is ready for paint. This is another one that's ready for paint. Basically, we're gonna just make this all white. All right. This room is already ready. You can see it's all skimmed out and everything. This room is ready for paint. So this is another room that we'll, we will be painting today. And right? hopefully we can have you online people see some of that. Now, that will work out pretty nice. It's a nice room, right? Cool little bedroom. All right, let's go in here. So now we have one of the guys that's working, smoothing down the walls. So we'd we'll be ready for paint. We'd we'll be ready for paint in that room, right? Yeah, that room. That room's yeah. ready for paint. Not this one yet. Not this one. Almost. Not, okay, good. So you see, this one's not ready yet. Almost done. Almost, almost done. Right? So we got that one. What about the, the, the master bedroom, right? Yeah. The mass, the master bedroom is ready. And this bedroom is ready. So those are some of the rooms we're gonna be painting. Alright, so let's go here. So now, the other thing that we're going to do next is we're going to, we're going to go this way, actually. You can see me better this way, right? I'm going to bring the team members up so you can meet everybody that's here. I'm going to bring everybody upstairs. The noise is coming from downstairs mostly. Yeah. All right, so we're going to bring, I'm going to bring everybody upstairs and, um, you can hear from everyone that's around. Or, or, or maybe we might just go to them. And this is tough. Yeah. Yeah. Jay. Jay. Jason. Bring everybody upstairs. Yeah. Everybody upstairs. Downstairs, come upstairs. Everybody. All right, everybody's coming in. This is a good room. Or maybe the master bedroom. The bedroom. Or this one. This is good. Come on in. This is Yvonne. Say hi. Hi, everyone. Team member. This is Gio. Say hi. Hey, everyone. Hello. Hello. Where is that? <laughs> this is Fagans. Another team member. Say what's up. What's going this on? This is Big Ron. Yo. Another team. I don't. I don't. He, he hides from the cop. <laughs> Y'all know Jason. Where's Sheldon? Sheldon, where you at? Sheldon. Come on. And this is Sheldon, right? These are some of our team members, and I know they got a look. They have they're doing some work downstairs, so I wanted to come up here and, and speak to a few of them. And we can start with Gio. Well, we, this one we we we're gonna start with Gio because he's right here. Gio now got his first wholesale deal. First wholesale deal. Yeah, yeah. We're right on. We're right on. <laughs> Did you see that? We let me tell you something. We rehearsed that. No, we didn't. For two days, <laughs> and everybody was off cue. Here's the deal. Jill got his first wholesale closed. When did it close? Thursday. Just closed Thursday. Um, Checks in the bank account. Checks in the bank. Right. Uh, and and, and I, I want y'all to hear from him a little bit. If you're going to ask any questions, you can ask on the chat. He's been with, how long you been? I've been here since last year, March. All right. Last year, March. 11 months now. 11 months, right? And tell us why did you decide, with all the things you could do, why you decided to go stay here? All right, so, you know, I bought my first house when I was 23. 
um, you know, my Dre is a team member. He was, you know, on Instagram, you know, telling me about it, that he's going to start investing in real estate. It was something that I wanted to do, but never, you know, did it because I didn't know where to start. So I talked to Dre. Dre told me to come through to the intro. I liked it. You know, Jason was there. He did the Velocity Ranking. That's what got me hooked. And um, after I went to another Super Society with Hugh, and then right after the Super Society, I signed right up, and here I am now, 11 months later. Two properties, oh, one just yeah. did a wholesale deal. What now I have a fix and flip. It's gonna be going to closing either this week or next week. We start doing a fix and flip on that one. Yes, so there's two, there's another property. Yeah. We got a two family. Two family. And a one fam, well, the two family. And then we got a few others, yeah. all right? So that's cool. Uh, what were you looking for before you found this? I was looking for anything. What were you doing? What were you I doing? Was, I was, I'm a mechanic. I work so how did you get into real estate then? Real it was just, yeah. I don't know, man. It was just there. And I was like, all right, let me just hop on to it. It was, no, it was nothing crazy. <laughs> this, is, this is what happens yeah, when you're I'm, young, a car, right? I'm a car guy, so, you know, the money I was about to spend on car parts to make my, you know, soup on my car, I just spent on the real estate. And, 11 months later, I'm here now. So there's no real reason why you're doing there's real estate? no crazy reason, just... just yeah. Well, that sounds good. Yeah. That sounds good. You don't need a reason. I don't need a reason. You just, <laughs> if you got nothing better to do, <laughs> then do this. If you got nothing better to do, <laughs> then, then let's, let's get some houses and, and you know, let's get some assets and, and, and build your wealth. I hear you. Who's up? Me. That's nah, I'm good. <laughs> you, you go ahead. I swear, come on, I'll talk a little later. You know, I keep talking. What we want, what, what we'd like you to do is, is meet some of the people that's part of the team because, um, you know, they have their reasons. They're just like some of the people that's watching online right now. If you're watching online, you're, you have your questions, you have things that you're wondering about. And these are some of the people that's part of the team. I, I feel that it's a good opportunity um, for, for everyone online to see some of the people that we're working with. The camaraderie that we have. No pressure, you live. <laughs> you live. No pressure at all. <laughs> this is Yvonne. How long have you been with us? Um, a year and two months. Wow. A year and two months. Yeah, and why? Tell us the reason that you actually said, you know what? I'm in with these guys and girls. Well, I, I, I like to be my own boss. Mm. Um, I'm a single mom. Um, I don't like being broke. And uh, uh, one of the reasons why this really brought home to me, because my dad is a retired architectural engineer. So um, when I was little, he used to bring me houses like this half done, you know, or just about to be just done. Just like this. Just like right. this. And, you know, he would tell me, okay, you guys gonna learn how to tile a floor today? Or are you gonna learn how to do some plumbing? Or, you know, just little things like that that girls don't normally do <laughs> at a young age. Okay. So this is like home for me. Um, also, you know, been I went through a hard time financially and, you know, this is my end all be all and I wanna be an example for my son, um, my sister, and first out of five girls and also for myself so I want to build a legacy right. so that's why I'm here right you do, you do real estate for your family yeah. right do it for them do it for yourself doing it for your family a lot of us we want to help our families do you know I always say that um, we come to the point where we want to save our parents or we want to save our families and some of you that want to save your family, this is the way to do it. You want to save your family, you can save your family. And, and I use that term loosely because mm -hmm. it depends on what you mean by save. One of the ways you can save your family is doing real estate, yeah. right? And why'd you pick us? Um, what'd you like? You just like the my community. Um, I didn't know how to get started or what to do when I get started, or <laughs> I knew I needed um, some form of mentorship. Um, and it's, it's the community that got me the support um, and it's, it's helped me to push myself to limits that I didn't think that I could get to, you know, doing certain things that I didn't see. I visioned doing it, but I didn't think of I would be actually like putting myself out there to get it done. So, you know, um, I'm grateful for that and that, that's what keeps me home because even though we're family, you know, they, they are still my family and all, you know. So that's, that's, that's why, yeah. All right, cool, cool.
There it is, a community. Who's up? Come on, Brian. All right, how you doing? <laughs> All right. Come on, nice to meet you. I just met you. I just hey, how's it going? Just, uh, did my head some people want to tell us. What's up, Dion? What's up? I see you guys online. Oh, you, you got, got some people online? I got people online. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Say what's up to your people. Thomas Dion, let's do Ron, Ron, Ron is, is a teacher by trade. Yes, and, unfortunately, um, yes. For some reason, he decided he decided that he wants to do real estate. You know what I'm saying? He's a teacher. Yes. So now, um, how long? I've been a teacher? How long have you been with us? I've been with you guys about two years and a couple months. Two years, right? Yeah, got in on one, one small deal with Joe. Right. But, uh, we got, we all did deal together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we got to deal together in Camden. Yeah. Yeah, we did something together. But it's about the team. You know what I mean? To be able to be around people who are doing what I want to do. This is a full-time investor. So I want to be around a full-time investor to learn from this. And then with the classes we have, second to none, I mean, this is it. Once you have the information, you got the team, you do it. Right. There it is. Information. That's it. Strategies. You can catch Ron Sunday. on his intro on Sunday, Sunday morning. Sunday morning. That's his church. That's his sermon time. That's it. He be preaching. <laughs> I don't preach. He's a prophet. <laughs> Definitely. Just, just the messenger. Come on. This is my guy right here. Uh, this is Sheldon. Let him see your face, man. There you go. How about this Sheldon? He's a straight Brooklyn knight, right? Straight out of Brooklyn, New York. Um, I met him a while ago. And he's and, and he's gone through different levels of change, different changes, different things. And uh, how long you been with us? Um, almost two years. Two years. Yeah. Two, I'm like you proud to be here. Two man. years. Wow. You don't think that <laughs> <here>? <laughs> <laughs> Two years. He's been here. So, um, why did you decide? What made you decide to to use this platform to help you with what you wanted to do? I believed in it. That's why. You know, I, I went to the exposures like everybody else that wanted to. You know, that was looking for an opportunity to change and you know do things better in life. So when I met you guys, you know, I went to the first exposure. Got in. Went to. The second exposure, it made sense to me, and then that was it. I didn't have to make a decision. And not even only that, like, before I even found out, I was already that type. Like, you understand? Like, just looking for the answers that I want. Right. So, when it just made sense. Right, right. And what are some of the good things that's happened to you since you've been here? Oh, man. Self-development, most importantly. You know, um... <laughs> Learning how to deal with with with, with uh, you know individual prospects and right. people just yeah people period and a, a lot man like business sense right and just more of a direction of where I want to go in life and how I want to lay my legacy. Yeah. You see that? Yeah. All right, exactly. that's good. Um, you know, a lot of times people think that this real estate. Those of you on here that think real estate is about houses. Right? There's a lot of houses. Right Listen, there. There's houses everywhere. There's houses everywhere. But I'm going to tell y'all, sometimes this business is usually about you, the person, and the people that surround you. This is a people business. 100%. Big shot. We'll be back. He'll be back. We're going to hear from people. Oh, you, you know, look, Jason the interviewed that had got somebody who was hiding a little bit. One of our team members. So it's not always about men doing real estate. You know, so you guys heard from Yvonne. But I've got another lovely lady, Bernadette. Bernadette, tell the people a little about yourself. I'm sure you got a few people online watching you. Introduce yourself. So tell them about yourself. Hi, guys. I'm Bernadette. I've been with the community for about over three years now. Uh, the reason why I joined was because I was laid off from my job. Laid off? Laid off. Mm. And after that. 20 years, I decided I didn't want to work for anyone anymore. I wanted to work for myself. And so I just started looking for opportunities and I stumbled upon and I made my decision and I've been with it ever since. So, so. why though? 
why did you choose this platform to start learning real estate and doing things? Because there's a lot of things out there. True. Why did you choose this community? Well, initially, like I said, since I was laid off, I needed income. Okay. So, and I'm being that I refused to get another job, then I did the marketing side of this business. But then when I attended the property tours and everything, I saw the excitement and everything that came along with it, and I decided that I wanted to be a part of that as well. Okay, so what has it done for you since you have, you know, got started? Like, what has it done for you personally? Anything? Personally? Yeah. Self-development. Self-development. Yes. Yeah. So you guys heard Sheldon say that too. So yeah. Self-development is definitely... Because any other time, I would not be standing in front of this camera. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and she's not lying. I literally had to grab her from back there. She was trying to hide. And I had to grab her to come up here. But you wow. see, but, yeah, she's it's standing not here. Bad. Okay. Yes. Yeah. One time we got her on stage, right? And she was literally shaking to the point where... You know her being in front. So the fact that she's here, right here, she look. She's her legs are shaking. Yeah. See, that's self development. <laughs> she's getting better at speaking in front of people. So this is great. But I this am anxious awesome. to do a real estate deal. Um, so I'm definitely looking forward to it. Okay. Yes. Cool. Thank you. One more. Thank you. Come on up, brother. <laughs> I want, I want the guests to talk too. Yeah, they come. We spoke to them. Yeah, you talk. Team. So, Fagans, this is one of our another team members, Big Fagans. Why? Why us? Why not? Um, I've been interested in real estate for about since 2008. Uh, and the reason why I chose this was because uh, it actually, in a broker who is investing in real estate said, um, don't get your license. Just go find a group to work with. That way you'll be able to learn how to do wholesaling and fix and flip. And one of the main reasons why I wanted to do this was because, you know, um, uh, I had a mom that was working and like, you know, struggling with jobs. She got laid off. And one of the things that made her survive and got us a house is the fact that she had her own business. Mm. So it made me realize like, hey, like, you know, one of the best businesses that I can actually do because real estate actually makes a lot of millionaires. So it made me want to, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> makes people. So I wanted to get into this and that's why I'm here. All right. So what has it done for you so far since you've been involved? Like what's um, it done for you personally? Well, <laughs> well, even with the little knowledge that I learned here, um, we actually was able to use, uh, get the house at HELOC to actually pay off the whole mortgage. So now she didn't have to work so hard to um, do those, you know, $2,000 um, mortgage payments. Now she can just put $100 down. Nice. I love it. Yeah. Good stuff. Good stuff. All right. And we spoke to him. We spoke to Murray? Okay. Yeah, we spoke to him. We spoke to him. We spoke okay, to Darry. Cool. Where was the other he, guy? He's, he's good. <laughs> oh, he don't want to get on the camera? Yeah, he don't want to get on the camera. He don't want to get on the camera. Good. So what we're going to do now is we're going to talk numbers, right? For those of you that are on here, uh, you met everybody. You met some of the people. You took a tour of the house. Uh, oh, let's. how about we... We're going to go to um, the main contractor who's, who's working on this property. I want you guys. I want everybody to meet him. He's also part of the team. Also, so, so we got contractors. We got yeah, I just the one, thing one of our team members that recent team members I enrolled here, big contractor. Oh, I saw right. him in the city. Yeah, yeah, yeah I saw him. Chef, right. Chef e. Yeah, yeah, no, I saw him. He's in Brooklyn. Right. Uh -huh. Yep, yep, yep. Right. So what you're gonna see is how we're able to kind of like do this together. You know, sometimes you want to do this by yourself. So just follow me. Let's doing this by yourself is very, very difficult. <laughs> oh, there he is. There he is. Listen to this guy. Look, look. There he said, this is our guy who is the master. I call him an engineer <laughs> extraordinaire. Right? Let me step in here with you. Come in here with you. So this is Clifton. He's also part of the team, right? Um, he, I know he has asp aspirations to not only build these things but also invest in them. 
I know this is some of the things, and that's how he's part of the team. He's been working super hard, diligently yeah, look, to that. get this thing. Look, look he's he, he, <laughs> right. He's look rocking, where he's at. Man. I really wanted to capture this. Look, this is this is live working, and and and, and again, um, a lot of a lot of the things with contractors and people working on your house. There's tons of horror stories out there, right? Tons of horror stories. But I can tell you that one of the reasons, one of the things that helps with the horror story is to, to have someone that's part of the community as well, right? Not just someone who's just out, and that's what I noticed about Pep. He's not just out for himself, right? He, he's one of those people that, that I've noticed that loves to help people and show people the right, the actually the right way to handle these things. And how long have you been in the business? 17 years. 17 years. Wow. That's, that's 17 awesome. years. Right? And when um when you met us, tell us one of the reasons why you actually decided to you know be part of this community. Well actually for me, it has been a uh, after me. Come out here, let's let's come this way. Come this way. We're gonna get a better ah so the light, the light is this way, right? So let's stand here. See, this is ready for you. This is ready for the painting. He set this up. Yeah. So now we can talk. Now we can talk to the yeah. Go ahead. Actually, for me, um, joining the community has been primarily has given me the, the opportunity to handle my own time and be more free up to do things I want to do. And more so, it actually gives me a chance to demonstrate my skills. So it's not like I'm deviating from my from my background. It, I, it's a win-win situation for me because it, I get to do the things I love to do. At the same time, I control my time, and my time is most important to me. Time, and of course, it, it's, everything is limitless. My income going to be directly proportional to my, to my, you know, to my efforts. It, being in an environment like that to me is a, is 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 a winner because I've worked in the corporate world for many many years. And there's nothing really compared to it when you have to handle your own time. That's true. Circumstances. That's true. You know, you you more or less like enjoy yes. a, a lifestyle rather than the standard of living. Standard of living is being controlled by the people who pay your paycheck. Mm. And of course, mm -hmm. you know, yes. <laughs> when you handle your own money and income, that's a lifestyle. So yeah, so that primarily has been my own. And after meeting Joe, Joe on his own, Joe is a cool cat. You know, he, can, he, he would know how to really tell you the idea actually to make you want to do this. Even right. so if you don't want to do it, he would make you want to do it, you know what I mean? Why not? Yeah, exactly. yeah you know, but yeah, but um, it's been a good ride with him. Working with, along with him, it's been a great experience. I'm looking forward to growing uh, much more into this business and going on with you guys. It's been a real pleasure. And um, Do you know how, do you remember how long it's been? It has been what, approximately two years, right? Two years. Two years. Yeah, two, two years. years. Yes. Two years, and then yes. this this project is probably the biggest one that he's working on yeah. with because he's basically he basically had to almost rebuild the whole house. Yeah. Because what what happened was we um yes, this project has taken a while, and one of the reasons is because the contractor before him kind of took us for a, a, the wrong ride, right? And that happens. So um, what we decided to do was change over to someone who was more for us, right? And then that's when he came in. And as you can see, the improvements, so, so you may not know, but trust me, the improvements and it being it. ready, you, you know, you, you gotta love it. You have to love it, all right? So you met our contractor. He's going, you're going back, where are you going back? What you gonna do now? We actually gonna be here until like, until, Probably Saturday. I'm pushing to finish this this section of the job until Saturday. This section, okay. Maybe Friday to Saturday. So we're gonna be working some extensive hours. Yes. At least that's how we, we roll. Sometimes we leave here at ten in the night. Yes. You know, just to really get the man. Yeah, you know. So And this room is ready for paint, right? This room is ready. The other room all those rooms are basically ready. It's just some final right, he's, he, my guy. He's he's doing doing it some little fine stuff I want him to do. And um, but this this room is ready. You notice the difference? You see, you see how smooth it is. Right, it's very smooth. You see that? Right. You can pass your hand with it. You see? It's yes. You see it's we don't have to brush any of that you stuff off. Just paint it to go. I have the um, I have the. You see, like this, we this this concrete behind here. Oh. This is actually laminate. 
I actually you laminated it. You see, see that? Oh, yeah, you laminated. There's no, there's no lumber behind here. Okay. Yeah. So it's like what is behind is like um, construction adhesive. It's behind it laminated. We made it to it. All right. Yeah. Awesome. So, awesome. All right. So we're gonna do next, right? Um, we're gonna go over some of the numbers of the property. Um, should we? Can I? I my, the, the the numbers part yeah, yeah. is downstairs. Right, so just follow me, we're going to go to the downstairs part.